Hey good people, this is Frida Nguku and welcome to another vlog. Subscribe just in case you're new here. So this is an old house that has been here for a very long time and the client partitioned the living room to get more space and she used plywood. On the front side we have a TV area that has a grey wallpaper. This wallpaper has been here for two years and what we want to do is remove it and have a black wallpaper on that side. On this other side we have plywood partitioning and the client wants to make this space still look comfortable and you know beautiful so she wanted to paint the plywood white so the black wallpaper was definitely going to blend properly with um, the white painting on the plywood with time she might think of installing wallpaper but for now we're working with one roll of wallpaper on the tv area and painting on these other sides which is a white paint now um what we're going to start doing first is remove the gray wallpaper so that we can be able to get a clean wall again for us to be able to install the black wallpaper all the way from the ceiling down to the floor that's another change that we're doing so on the plywood she's going to have more plywood um put on the top of this side so that she can paint a smooth consistent wall let's take a look as we do the removing remember i have a video still on this channel that tells you guys and shows you guys how you can remove a wallpaper for yourself in case you want to change the color theme of your house and like i said it does not destroy the wall it leaves the wall as was and you are about to see that so stay tuned and give this video a thumbs up take a look Most of you ask a lot about whether the wallpaper will destroy the wall and that is what I am about to show you right now. As you can see it was so sticky even after two years of installation that I had to actually use my cutter to be able to create um, a space for me to be able to get it off. You can't even tell where the line is. So that's what happens. You just peel off the top part of the wallpaper and sometimes it comes out fully and sometimes there's the inner part, the white patches that you're seeing. Um, the inner part that is left on the wall and that is where we use water to be able to pull it off forget my matutas <laughs> forget my bad hair day and just enjoy the video and learn something from it <music> I'm going to leave it on the description box, but I want to show you that some parts will be out, the old paper will be out, but then the inside paper that sticks with the glue is still here. So I'll be showing you how to do that again, just in case you did work that video in a few. But first, you remove, make sure everything is out. can see the wall is still as was nothing has happened to the wall For those who ask does it destroy the wall no it doesn't so i want to show you on the places that uh the old paper came out completely you see the wall is still as was the dirt that was there before installation is still there that dirt now the white pieces you're seeing is what I want to remove with uh, with water and all you do if you've not watched that video please watch so I'm just going to apply some water on it to apply some water this is our just wet tamba apply some water just make it wet then you just peel so that's how it peels off that's why you say it's normally removed with water so when you peel the wall the wall is left as was during installation nothing has been destroyed everything comes out easily so the water removes it because the glue that we install with uh, you mix it with water so when you use water on it it's like you're trying to dilute it so the paper just peels off 
properly and leaves the wall as was during installation. <laughs> the wallpaper is out and this is how the wall looks like i'm going to focus a lot more on the wallpaper because that's my speciality and what you're seeing is that the wall still looks the way it was before the other wallpaper installation so no it does not destroy the wall nothing happens to the wall you just remove and you're back to what the wall looked like so i've already installed the first piece of the black wallpaper that i'm supposed to do on this so in case you're interested in wallpaper kindly call me on 07 and i'll send you samples for you to choose from now let's look at what happened to this house total transformation enjoy and leave me a comment finally done all there was painted white and the black wallpaper was so amazing on this white plywood paints um so the black wallpaper really blended perfectly with this white and of course to give that contrast on the tv area and the funny thing is when you have a black wallpaper on the tv area somehow you get to watch tv more either black or gray it just makes the tv stand out as you can see um what is what I'm about to see there look at how that tv is so transparent you can literally just see what's happening sorry this was actually shot at night <laughs> so this is the before in case you forgot this is how the house was looking before and uh i am sure you can see the difference compared to you know the after and i want to be able to show you the after during the day because the previous after was actually taken during the night so coming in through this small door here that i'm opening right now to a white clear perfect house look at that wallpaper Remember guys, you can have a wallpaper of your choice. They come in different colors, textures, whatever it is that you choose. So the window you're seeing on the left there, or is it right actually, we're going to have another yellow um, curtain to be able to bring that, um, how do I put it? How do I say it? To have a balanced, yes, a balanced house of this side of having yellow curtain and the other side yellow. But anyway, let me know what you think of the house so far with that black wallpaper right there and the white paintings and also, how amazing did this cardboard really transform thank you for watching this video up to this far kindly get onto the description box for all the details and in case of anything reach out to my pages at join my call papers and deco and we will call you back thank you and enjoy your day